Uh, okay, just these two sentences then. I'm at man. The VMA rookie. I'm Avril Lavigne, the VMA rookie. <laughs> Do we absolutely have to leave? <laughs> um, I would say uh, 10 minutes. Okay. At this moment, I'm talking to a lens and the guy behind the camera. But in a bit, this is going to be going out to the world. So really, I'm talking to a whole bunch of people. And that's trippy. <laughs> I don't even remember my day right now. Remind me. Uh, where are we going today? Tell us what we're doing. Um, right now we're on our way to get into a van, and that van's going to take us to a radio station, and we're going to play an acoustic, do an acoustic set of like three songs for um, winners. some winners. Winners. <laughs> we love winners. <laughs> oh my god, come on. <laughs> we're walking outside, there's a limo pulled up, and I was like, Ugh. I hate limos. I mean, it's like they're cool and stuff and they're fun, but at the same time, it's like, please, stop it. There you go. Oh. High fives. Where are we? Uh, 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 this is where <laughs> Usher's from. Uh -uh. It's Woo! Come on. No. Hey, go. <laughs> I only did that to freak you out, you know. Right, the radio show. That was that was cool. Um, sometimes the radio station will put on, like, put together a, like a little meet and greet where I come in and do an acoustic set, sing a few songs. We've got a room for you guys over here with some beverages, and it's your private room if you want to come in. This is what I ate last night for supper. This is what I ate last night for supper. Okay, you can't drink pop before you sing. When I drink pop, when I go to sing, all I do is burp when I'm up in front of the microphone. I'm like, bleh, bleh, bleh. So I'm gonna drink some pop. <laughs> you know most Americans don't call it pop. Oh, you call it soda, don't you? So you want some good news before you guys go on? I just got off the phone with Shauna, and you're, uh, playing the pre-show at the VMAs. All right. High fives. High fives. She's really much more excited than she looks. That's awesome. <laughs> so, and I'm, I think I'm presenting an award, too. That's really cool. That's very cool. People are oh, like, Congratulations. Thank you. I'll go find out when we're on. No, I want you to talk about like playing up there after you know the history that's been up on that, that marquee. I mean, that's... Honestly? Yeah, I don't know too much about, I don't even know where it is. I don't know anything. <laughs> All I know is that I'm really excited because it's an award show. It's an award show. Ah! You know, I'm, f I'm from Canada, so we didn't get MTV, and I've only started watching MTV. Started a little, about a couple years ago. There's gonna be a lot of people there, and like, it's gonna be like, it's MTV, it's gonna be all across America. That enables me to share my music with the world. Wait, we have to sing Complicated. What's well, easy to start with, mobile? Easy on your voice, nobody's fool. Nobody's fool, complicated. Skater boy? And then if you feel like it's mobile. Okay, nobody's fool, complicated, skater boy. Yeah. All right. No, we like the video. This is a really cool room. You dig it? Awesome. That was really cool one today. I think today was my favorite out of uh, every time I've done that. The kids there were fans. Um, they knew my music. It was, it was like a really cool, cool vibe in there, really cool atmosphere. If there's anybody out there that would like to ask a question of Avril Lavigne? Just a little girl. When do you get to go out and have some fun? <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> I'm out right now, and I'm having fun right now. It just might, you know, it's... I, I am having fun, I'm having a lot of fun. I mean, I guess what you probably mean is like, 
can I go to the movies with like friends and can I go shopping and that kind of stuff. Um, I, I saw some powers, like I mean, I sometimes, sometimes I get to go out and do stuff. So, but not very often. You strike me as a person that wants to also remain as normal as possible, mm -hmm. right? Totally, because I am normal. Yeah. <laughs> I don't ever want to be one of those people who have a big head and think that there's something special. And I'm no better than anyone else, and no one else is any better than me. Fans come up to me and, and tell me that I'm just being myself and I don't care about what other people think and, and that like I act like myself. When fans come up to me and say that kind of stuff, it just, you know, puts a smile on my face that's, you know, very irreplaceable. Like just touches me and it just makes me so happy. I had fun. Did you get some new bracelets? Yeah. They always come up to me and want some of mine, so I give them some of my bracelets and they give me some of theirs. Yeah. I just love it when guitar. people like come up to me and they're like, "You're so cool. You like yourself. You don't okay. like, you know, like um, get all caught up in bullshit." The fans are like the most. They're so awesome. So awesome. I love them so Where is much. It? We're we're playing. That's really cool that we're performing on the rooftop. It's really fun. Have you ever seen the VMAs when? The no. I'm just really excited That's that, where all like. Fans were. <laughs> we're gonna win. That's we're gonna win. No, we're not. We're gonna win. No, we're not. If we don't win, then we deserve to win. You heard um, it here first. Everyone's a winner. I don't know, it's just happening so fast and, and that's, that being nominated, oh my god, I'm being nominated. That's so cool, like, I'll, now the rest of my life I can say I got nominated for something, you know? This might be the only time this ever happens. When I was younger, like all growing up, whenever I watched award shows, I'm like, I'm gonna be up there one day doing that. And now I get to go and have some fun. And now the rest of my life I can say that I got nominated for something. If I win or if I don't, which I'm not gonna, because my prediction is Ashante. Thank okay. you. Have a good day. You too, yeah. Uh, we're sleeping here tonight. You bet. Two sleeps. Two sleeps in one bed. One bed. That's okay. Japan. Japan, eight sleeps in one bed. Right? Yeah. That's awesome. I live out of, literally, live out of a suitcase, so it's not like I can wake up and be like, what am I gonna wear today? And walk over to my dresser and be like, ah, oh, what shirt should I wear? So this is my life, this is my suitcase. This is my suitcase that I can literally fit in. It's so big. This is my suitcase. And these are all my hair products. I, I like Dickies, they like, like give me stuff, so. These are all my hair products. <laughs> this is something you won't see me with very often, but I do own a purse. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen it. <laughs> yeah, you haven't seen it. You don't use it though, right? Nothing um, no, sometimes, you know, sometimes. <laughs> Look what's in my purse, my great popcorn. <laughs> um, sometimes I have moments, there's, I have a Blackberry. This is the one that I wore in the Skater Boy video. I wore this tie. And this is the knot that was in it. And I'm not gonna take it out. I just like, I think it'd be cool if I don't untie this tie. I leave it as how it was tied in the video. Just for like my own sake. Sometimes I wonder if like, you know, like what I really want is to have a long career and like, cause I'm so young now, and if I keep making records, every record's gonna be like different and like I'm 17 and I'm growing up and as I get older and I'm maturing more and going through different things and I'll write about other stuff. I, I wonder sometimes, I'm like, I wonder what my style or whatever is gonna be like at, in like a couple albums, if I'm gonna be like more like, like, or like when I'm like 25, if I'm gonna be like mom looking or like, I don't know. Do you know how to be a celebrity? Do I know how to be a celebrity? I don't know if I know how to be a celebrity. I know how to act like myself, and that's what I'm doing. That's all I'm worrying about. Okay, are we coming back? Yeah. 
We're gonna go straight over to the gig after we eat. Okay. What shoes should I wear? These? Yeah, I think I'll wear these. A lot of firsts this year. A lot of firsts, yes. Okay. My first time, my first I've award show no, was the Much Music Video time. Awards. My first nomination, my first video, my first CD. My fans are my first fans ever. <laughs> that makes sense. Um, my first time leaving North America. The first time having my own band. It's the first time that this, the void that I've had is being filled because now I'm finally getting to do what I wanted to do all my life, and that's be in the spotlight and share my music with the world. And I'm so happy. I'm really, really happy. Hey, you guys having a good day? Oh, yeah. Good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love the guys so much. We're all just, you know, we're a total family. I love them all so much. I love them all equally. And they're my bros, they're my boys. They're amazing. We're performing at the MTV Video Awards. High fives. Of course we're performing at the Yeah, we rule! Yeah! Of course, what song? Um, I think we might be doing Skater Boy and Complicated. Of course. We're playing on the roof. What? Of course. Where else would we play? That's our new thing now with this band. Like, cause every day something crazy is like you're doing this now. So every day we just wake up and go. Where are we going? We're going to the venue. We're going to go rock and roll. No, we're not leaving yet. Okay, we're not. <laughs> Okay, so you're you're driving up with us? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get you guys in the gang here. Um, what time is it? Talking about. What time is it? It's uh, 20 after. And and we go on at 40 after. What's that? We go on at 7:40. I believe so. Well, I think it's been changed to 8 o'clock now. Um, because remember, I have to do my warm ups, I think, in the car. I mean, even before the record came out, people like downloaded stuff off, uh, downloaded my songs off the internet and were like, knew all my lyrics and stuff. Like, even before Complicated came out and I was playing that song live, there'd be like people up on stage like that knew all the words to all my songs. And like, I thought that was cool. Because like, before any of this happened with me being all over TV and in in the magazines, people knew who I was and liked me and, you know, took the time to download my songs and learn all the lyrics. is that you say what you feel and you're not afraid to say it. I admire you for doing what you want and saying what you feel without letting anyone change you. I'm so glad that people notice that. It's so awesome. All right, guys, put it in. Ready? Mother You guys start, Matt. Matt. Right here. Matt, you start and then I run up after? While I'm doing the fill, you run up. Okay. When you hear ticket 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 When you see me run, okay? Count to two. It's like I run and you go one, two, run out. The vocals weren't that great, but it doesn't matter because I just had fun. The crowd was like so into it and you know, we connected. Like everything's just so new and I'm just like sitting with my eyes wide open like, ah, 
I'm just taking it all in. I'm just having so much fun. All the hard work that everyone has put into this project has, has definitely been paying off, and, and it's so it's really re rewarding to be going to an award show. Um, it's, it's the coolest thing. I know how lucky I am to have all this like success and and fans and. Fame. I'm so lucky because there's so many people out there who are talented and who work so hard and unfortunately they don't get this far so I know and I always remind myself as to how lucky I am. So, so lucky. Thank you for today. Hey, thank you. Very cool. Thank Have a good you. night. Thank you. Thanks everybody. See you at the VMA. Thanks a lot. Okay.